Right, hey guys, Trey for Christian here today with, and we're back with Evangelion episode 24. This has been such a long journey, fucking hell, it's quite sad to see it coming towards the end. No, it's weird, like, fucking hell. Started this, what, months, months and months ago, and I just slowly got through it, and I started to obviously do more regularly one a week, and look where we are now, episode 24. It's been a good journey so far. Um, yeah, last episode was definitely a... I would say somber is quite sad. Ray's, Ray's memory being reset like that, it's just like, that sucks ball. So like the first one was killed and we've lost the second one. So basically Ray's back to square one again um, with the development. So technically we did lose Ray, to, we lost Ray. Like we knew for, since episode one we've lost her, which is pretty sad because obviously she, she grew a lot towards like, um At first they didn't really do much of her character. And then towards the end they did loads of her and she grew quite a lot. And just to see that just go because she's technically dead now is pretty sad. Um, but she went out and sacrificed herself for Sinji. Obviously, Asuka broke down again. Um, things are just getting worse and worse for her. Uh, yeah, Asuka getting worse and worse. And then you just got stuff with Misa going on. But yeah, I always want to say thank you guys for everyone who leaves comments. I always do read through them. I might not give the longest reply back, but I do always read through them. I always enjoy reading your guys' comments. And you're always like, you, you either bring me to a weirdness or something, which makes the show ten times more enjoyable when something I miss makes no sense, but then you want you guys to clear it up. Um, but yeah, no, it's been a great ride. I've enjoyed having you all along. Like, you've all, it's been a few of you who's been around since the start, a few of you joined along on the ride, and you've all commented great comments, and you've been around. And I just want to say thanks for everyone who comments, I always appreciate it. And anyway, but now let's get to this reaction. So, yeah, please like and subscribe if you enjoy, guys. I do the other seasonal anime, along with a few live action shows. So, yeah, guys, I'll be doing a poll. At, I'll be doing a new show after I finish Evangelion. So, if any of you got any show recommendations you want me to watch, put them in the comments below. Um, from now until the last episode, I'll go over the last few episodes again to grab any of the names you've put down. I'll put them in a poll to put up. But for that, guys, I'm looking forward to just getting into this. So, let's get started. So, oh my. Do, 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 do. Oh, it's gonna be one of the last few times I listen to this intro. I fucking love this intro. <laughs> it's never got old. I've watched it every episode. I've watched it all the way through, and it's never got old. Why does Asuka always have the creepiest fucking flashbacks or mental states? I should say. Aww. And the mum never looked at her. I can imagine that going through your head all the time. Oh yeah. Oh shit. She just found that. She, yeah, she wouldn't have known yet, would she? That's not going to go well for her. God, she does look malnourished. She's not been eating. Fucking hell. Oh, is that? Do you know what? That reminds me of 13 Reasons Why. Um, I thought the water was just rust water, but that looks like blood. So, can someone just clarify? Did she attempt suicide? I'm guessing she did. Someone as strong as Asuka attempting suicide is a massive deal. She's especially someone who's been as strong as Asuka throughout those series. I know obviously she's deteriorated loads, but the fact that she would even do suicide is pretty damn deep. And I love how subtle that is as well. We're like fucking drawn into. They're already replacing her. That was a creepy shot. Aww. How are these pilots meant to have stable minds? <laughs> Fuck's this Ain't introducing a character this late. I don't think he's gonna live very long. Oh, look, a friend for Sinji. Another person to socialise with. Hmm, guess he needs it. He's like Loki creepy. Okay. He's not the angel. Nah, that wouldn't be a nose. I wonder what happened to the angel without below in the basement, actually. Mate, since she just wants a friend. <laughs> I guess to live with Vasco before that time, she's finally not there. It'd be a bit weird. Especially with all the friends leaving as well. What the fuck was that in his hand? 
What the? Oh, is that Adam in his hand? Uh, looks like a um, env envy off um, Full Metal. Mm. No, not Pen Pen. They've been together since the start. Aww. Don't mean so it survives. I'm shocked they introduced someone so late. Mate, so you probably open up to this random guy. Oh, so he sent my seal. Fucking Just a bit. He's definitely shady. Not well, Misa's got all the access. What the fuck? Oh, starting the music again. Mate, Asuka's not looking great. Fucking hell. I'm gonna be Eva versus Eva. Alright, this thing she's gotta fight this person. Who are these guys? Mate, the fucking angel's getting more and more advanced. I see where Sinji's coming from, but obviously it's only been like a few days, which didn't help. If he was in the series a bit longer, that would have been interesting. But I can see where Sinji's coming from. So what, Ray's the same as him then? That's a good way of getting us the angel law. No. I'm deep. It's suddenly escalating. Mate, so much is fucking happening here. Mate. Get him quick! Did you make it in? I'm about to give him a little glow. Why does this all remind me of Mass Effect's Reapers and um, Humanity? Ooh. I don't want to wait for like, a crush. Coming in it. Oh, the intensity of the shot.
Oh, I knew it was going to happen. <laughs> Fucking that was such a long wait on that shot. Well, I said Sinji was stable. I don't think he's going to be stable after this. Hmm. Looks like we go straight into the end of Evangelion before we do the actual last two. Um, so, that was definitely an interesting episode. So, obviously, with the whole Miso not being able to face Miso, um, Ray, and Asuka, with Asuka running away as well. Looks like Sinji just sort of like had everything burned onto him. And then he met someone who... Um, was friendly, needed the comfort he needed, and then Sinji just fell into that comfort, and then we found out it's a fucking, like, this, what is it, an angel? I didn't expect him to be an angel, got to be honest. Um, yeah, he's an angel, so yeah, um, that obviously destroyed Sinji's trust there. But yeah, it was something someone you can confide in, like, and then obviously going into, I love you, I said I love you, especially with someone like Sinji's character. Where the only interaction he's really had is with Misa, who's an old, older woman, Ray, who's sort of, like, cut off from... It's quite off, especially with her being reborn again. And then Asuka, who's unstable as fuck at the moment and not really. She's not really someone who could show Sinji comfort, let's be honest. So to feed a character like that and then that obviously just betrayed him again. That was an interesting little direction talk. I think it was a bit quick, the relationship getting together. Um, I would say quick, but because we know Sinji's mental state, I understand why he fell for him so quickly and um, why I was upset. But yeah, no, something to jump into with that guy being an angel. So yeah, we've got a lot in this episode. So we obviously got Sinji... First love, in a way. Um, Asuka's attempted suicide, which fucking hell. I only just read that. That's bad. Um, I don't get what Wave was doing this episode. That's all went over my head. Um, I'm guessing she's an angel. Because she's saying the same as him. So, yeah. Or because she's made from that. I don't know. That, that, that bit's a bit all over the place for me. There could be many reasons for that. Um, and then a bit with me so and Sinji at the end, which was pretty neat. But, yeah. Uh, whew, that was a pack four episode. Um part four episode there um, a lot went on angel finally made it down below looks like we're getting the final the episode is going to be interesting but i'm just going to do end of even getting first um but with that guys hopefully you enjoyed this reaction fuck it out that bit with asuka has got me it's two attempts to do i can't believe i didn't notice that i thought it was like rusty water i didn't fucking even think it was blood that's fucking i can't believe i didn't notice that yeah that's bad um but guys hopefully you enjoyed this reaction i hope to see you in evangelion and we'll be doing uncut and peace